We're crazy about it, but we realize a lot of people have limited space. So what we've done is a compact version of our little mini uh, potting station. Uh, this is actually the, uh, the, I think our very first airing. Yep, brand new Never today. seen it before. Uh, the whole thing, the design is a folding design, so you can fold right. it away, but it's got everything you need to do all your gardening, but you don't have to get down on the ground. It, exactly, it's the perfect table. You know, we're calling this the mini folding potting not bench, mini, Pete. but it's it's really not that it's, it's no. certainly not mini it's a small compact table that you're going to be able to use and again we're calling it a potting bench but there's so many different things that you can do with this including having it inside indoors because it looks so great you can see it has that oil stain look to it mm -hmm. it is a beautiful wood look you've got the lattice on the back you even have the area right here where you can hang the hooks it comes with five of those s hooks that you can hang utensils and certainly your your potting tools and things like that gardening tools on there all of that's amazing this will hold 200 pounds so if you can put 100 pounds on each shelf you're set to go great look but here's the thing that separates this from any other piece of furniture or a potting bench or anything else that you're using outside that this is going to fold up so it's going to be so incredibly easy to store so guy you know what to do all we're doing is, mm -hmm. is taking that bracket back there. You just break that by bringing it forward. And now we fold that up. So now you can see, and it's not very heavy either, no. that when I, sh I show you this this way, you can see it's low profile. It's narrow. Now you can put this, you know, in the garage. Yep. Honestly, you could put this in a, a pantry and just lean it against the wall. You could put it on the side of the garage. It's so simple. If you have a small porch or patio, maybe you have it set up, but then you just fold it and lean it against the wall until you actually need it. It, it really allows everyone now to have mm -hmm. something like a potting bench because it's similar to what we just talked about. So when you unfold it, then just make sure that bracket locks into place yep. on the side and you're set to go. It allows everyone to have that area to do their gardening, but it doesn't have to be a permanent spot because many of us don't have, have the space for that. But there you can see <coughs> your plants on the top and the bottom. You can yeah. put your, we have the coil hose coming up. All that'll fit on that bottom shelf. I like the bottom shelf for the, for the heavy stuff. If you've got the big bags of mulch and potting soil and things like that, put that on the bottom shelf and then use that top area for your yeah. workspace. What you're looking at there, that's the larger version, but we wanted to show you how it actually Yeah, you can barely tell works. the difference. Just a um, little bit yeah, smaller. Yeah, it's, it's just a, gives you a little less, uh, you know, a little, a little less room to, to have to put this somewhere. It gives you more options to put it anywhere yeah. you want. Hey, listen, and if you don't want to use this just as your potting station, I know a lot of people that use this as a barbecue station. Uh, they the use it as station a, for the barbecue. As a Great. bar, it's a perfect bar for that as well because you got a little to bar towel rack right here, so you can put things yep. here. I mean, it's it's ideal for any use that you want to use it for. Yeah, because you can use this if you're doing some entertaining. If you are having the barbecue. You're having a little summer party, you get together, family reunion party. This is great before the barbecue where you can have this and have the prep station, but use this as that serving area. Use this as that buffet serving table. You can put all the food or just the drinks on here and you're set to go, but you don't have to have it out there all the time. You can fold it up, put it away, put it in the garage and you're set to go. But here again, we're talking it as a potting bench. It is amazing. If you're like Guy and you've gotten a bit older and you don't want to be down on your hands and knees, you know, trying to do all that, you know, planting or transplanting, this is perfect. It's right at that, that countertop height. It's 35, just over 35 inches wide and then 24 inches deep on these shelves. So it's a great size. It's perfect for all those planting jobs you want to do. Mm -hmm. And remember, very strong, very well made. You've got 100 pounds on each shelf, 200 pounds total. It'll take about two people, maybe 25 minutes yeah, to put this take together. Long. No, and it's, it's already, easy to put it's already uh, pre stained. Uh, if you want, yeah. you could change it, you could paint it, do sure. whatever you want. We've, oh, yeah. we've talked about that before. Uh, but the real fun part, again, about this is that when you do want to put it away, so you simply easy. bend it, fold it back up together, and that's it. And you can move it anywhere you need. I only have a thousand of these to go around. These all have to be put together by hand. So there's a lot of work in, in putting this together. But I'll tell you something you get it home, you're going to absolutely love it. It, it gives you. A, you know, it just gives you a chance to have a place to do the job that you need to do rather than just sitting on a bucket in the grass trying to do your potting. And we've got some examples of this one over here. Yeah, let's Pete. look at that one. Yeah. And there you can see the S hooks. You can see them on the video we're showing mm -hmm. right now. But we've got it comes with the five S hooks to go on that lattice, which is on that background area there. So, again, oh, there it is using it as a serving table, buffet table. I mean, look how great that looks. If you left it there permanently, it's a great piece to add to your patio furniture. Honestly, we've had reviews and callers telling us, I use it inside. I need a little bit of extra yeah, counter nice. space. I can push it up against a, a wall. You can use it as a decorative area, or you can use it really as a functional counter space, serving space, whatever it is, inside, 
or outside, it's perfect. Here again, we've got it loaded up with everything you need to get your gardening together. And here are those S hooks that I told you about. You know, here we're hanging the spray bottles. Mm -hmm. You could obviously hang all your garden tools on there, whatever it is. But this is perfect. And honestly, it's brand new today. It's the first time we've had what we're calling the mini version. But it's not a mini version. It's only slightly smaller no. than the larger one. But still, I think the perfect workspace for anybody who just, and we all do, need actually, a little extra space. I actually like this size better. Yeah. I, for me, I think this is a better size because most people don't have a lot of space when they put this into If you wanted to put this in a garage or I've got a shed in the backyard, it's perfect for something like that where you can store tools. You can get things up off the floor. You no longer have to be uh, chained down to the bottom there and, and working on your hands and knees. As you can see, there's storage for everything with this. It's the it's the best quality you know when you get this home you're going to see that we've got a great deal on it today because we're i think we took 20 dollars off the price we did it's also on flex space so you get it home for about a third of what it would normally cost you 33 32 and just decide what you want to do with it for many of you uh you might want to leave it um inside because it's nice enough like i said to keep it inside you could uh bring it outside and use it next to your barbecue if you wanted to absolutely where are we going we're going I over like there that. No, I just want, right I, again, I wanted to show how we're okay. folding this up because that's okay. why it's perfect for everyone. Wherever you use it, wherever you want to keep it, it's just about five inches off that wall. That's how narrow we can make this or how slim and low profile. Again, you're just going to break that bracket. Yep. Not break it. What's the word? <laughs> just bend the bracket bend a little bracket. bit. You want to release it a release little bit. Release the bracket. Yes. You fold it up extremely lightweight. And I'll turn this around again so you can see that. So one person carrying this, putting it away is very easy. And there it is. There's the bracket we're talking about. When you open it up, that just locks into place to keep it sturdy. And remember, once you do that, you can have 200 pounds on here, 100 pounds on mm -hmm. either shelf. So that's it right there. And then all I'm doing is locking that bracket into place, and you're set to go. But you will use this. Guy, are you still using that, that white plastic table that you take out for using it near the barbecue when you need extra space? You know the one, the card yeah, table. Yeah, I know side. the one you're talking about. Yeah, You've the cheapo one. one. The cheapo nah, one. Nah, it's gone. But I mean, I mean <laughs> that's, you got rid of that? Yeah, I did. <clears throat> so you no longer have to do that. Use that, that old, you know, white table. It's right. plastic. Right. This is a beautiful way to not only, you know, do the hard work, if you, you call your planning, you know, hard work or your, your DIY jobs outside, but really use this for serving, use this for entertaining, use this for the barbecue grill, it use this so as nice. the serving table. It's, it looks great. It, it looks like, you know, honestly, like you had something handmade for yourself. It really has that look to it, rather than, like you said, the cheap plastic, which really just looks terrible. This this is, as we said, that, you know, it's, it's when you look at how it's made, you'll see that there's a lot of quality that goes into this. And Peter's right, you know, if you want to use it as a, as a place to put your bar outside, on a, on, you know, it's a nice day. You can bring it out onto the patio, and then you got your temporary bar. You can fold it up when you don't want to use it. If you want to use it full time as a potting station, you can have it always set up to do that. Sure. We're going to do some potting in just a sec to show you how that works. But I'm telling you, it is easy to get this thing home, put it together in about 15, 20 minutes, and you've yeah. got a beautiful station to do all your work. I think you're going to find when you get it home, you're going to say, wow, this is a pretty nice potting bench. Yeah. Maybe I should use this you know, as a permanent fixture on the patio or in the house and really display it, load it up with your, with your serving ware and your glasses and things like that or make it that permanent, you know, drink station, bar station outside. It's absolutely perfect. There it is again. That's the look I like. I mean, look how great that looks in that area on your porch look and patio. Look at you made a little salad bar, Pete. Yeah, I mean, it's so right? nice because I think you're going to be impressed with how good it looks. What a great look this is to have outside. And again, sure. it's super functional well, as well. You're doing a brunch outside and you want a little station to put all your stuff. You could put your salads and you could That's do all it. that stuff. You bring it indoors on a holiday if you need extra space to store things. Absolutely. Extra, extra uh, places to put food and stuff like that or plates. It'd be a great little buffet serving area for that too. You really, only your own imagination. So you can you can utilize this any way. But literally, when you, what you would go and spend for a cheapo table, sure. you get something that's really nice and has that handmade finish that handmade look to yeah, it. Exactly. A real piece of furniture that does fold up so storage is easy, but I think you're going to find the place inside or outside that you can have this permanently displayed because it's that nice. That oil yeah. stained wood looks great and it does fold up when you do want to store it. All right, I got about 900 or so to go around. It's $99.95. You can split up the payments, break it up into three payments uh, to get it home. Uh, you're going to absolutely love it. I know Pete's sticking around. We got more stuff yeah. going on. I wanted to remind you, too, uh, before you go anywhere, it's that time of year again. We have not seen spray and grow with uh, Bill's fertilizer since last year in June. It's now been